And basically we have one big problem that the students are trying to work through together in separate teams divided into planets and they report back to Mission Control which is Wheeling Jesuit University, NASA and through that project-based learning they come up with an end solution and a hypothesis as to where the space shuttle is and what it needs in order to basically rescue the space shuttle and the astronauts involved. Navigation spe specialists will write the coordinates of an unknown that is closest to their planet. Then you're going to report that information um, to me so that we can get some more information on what these unknowns are and find out if it's an asteroid, if it's a comet, or it could be our distant discovery, our lost ship. So NASA's right now trying to determine exactly what some of these known unknowns might be. Um, and as soon as I get any information here, I will share that with you. So do you copy, Kenzie? Copy that. We're just waiting for um, further calculations on the uh, cargo uh -huh. specialist. I have Jupiter's cargo. Excellent. Go ahead, sleep. Um, it is 24 water bottles. Okay. And five crates. Okay. Thank you, Jupiter. That sounds a lot better to me. We don't want to make this ship too heavy when we're going out to Jupiter. Great job. I'm Jenna Calderon, and we just did our E mission for Mrs. Brighter's class. And it was really intense today because we knew that if we didn't save the astronauts, it would have been bad and they would have been sad. And it was hard because we had to do math and work with symbols and work as a group, which isn't easy. It was fun because we've never done something like that before and it was a privilege to do that. We do have docking, I repeat, we do have docking. This is excellent news. Give yourselves another big round of